Hi, fourth graders. For your foundations lesson today, you're going to be thinking about related words. So what do we remember about related words? Related words are words that all share the same root word or base word. So remember when we talked about big, bigger, biggest, they all say share the same root word of big. Okay, that's just one example. Or large, larger, largest. Um, sun, sunny, sunniest. Okay, so usually we can make related words by using the root word and then adding prefixes or suffixes. So prefixes are word parts at the beginning of the root word. And then suffixes are word parts that we add to the end of the word. All right, so let's do an example here. I'm going to erase this big, bigger, biggest, see if it'll let me. Okay, and I'm going to, and I want you to either follow along or just listen closely. I'll use my pen. Okay, I'm going to draw a circle. I'm going to make a web. And the exact example I'm going to use is happy. Okay, and I want you to think about what the root word is for happy. It's just happy, right? There's no word inside that lives of that lives inside of happy. It's just happy. So we're gonna think about what are all of the words that we could make that use the root word happy. Okay, so the easiest thing to do is you can think about um, the antonyms, so opposite. So I could add a prefix un to the beginning of happy to make it unhappy, okay? I could think about when I am most happy, what is that word? Happiest, and I want you to notice here what happens is my Y, I end up turning it into an I, okay? For some special endings, you drop the Y and add an I instead. So unhappy, happiest, happier. So again, I'm using that base word and I'm adding either prefixes or suffixes. Notice I also had to change the Y here to an I. So happy, unhappy, happiest, happier. Um, let's see, happy. I think those are all the ones I can think of. So in your activity today, I'm going to give you a list of a couple of words that you get to choose from. This time, the last time you did this activity, you were able to choose any word that you would like. This time I'm making it a little bit more difficult by giving you a choice list. So you must choose one root word from that list to complete your web on. And I really want you to challenge yourself and think, can I at least come up with four um, new words using my root word to complete my web, okay? And then when you have your words, you also need to, underneath each word, tell me quickly what it means. So unhappy would mean not, should be an O, not happy, okay? We can say happiest means when you are most happy, okay? And then most happy and happier it would be when you are more happy okay more happy Ooh, i thought of a fourth one now that i was here sorry i'm trying to use cursive to write quickly so my fourth one would be happily happily this is probably better if you um type okay happily and i added the suffix ly which means to act in a way of being happy. So I could write that as my definition, to act as a way of being happy. So I have my root word happy and my four related words, happier, unhappy, happiest, and happily. I have written the word and the meaning underneath, and then now I would be ready to submit. All right, fourth graders, that's it for your foundations quick mini lesson for related words.